Hi, today I want to talk about forward, reverse sense and anti-sense primer and uh, I want to start with uh, this picture of the double-stranded DNA and this is going to be here message RNA and here is going to be DNA double-stranded DNA and the reason why I show message RNA and top strand of the uh, double-stranded DNA in the same color is uh, because this is going to be the same code on the message RNA strand and on the top DNA strand for example here if we have uh, A U G C a on this strand of the DNA we would have A T G C and A. So as you see this is going to be the same sequence except uh, here we have uracil and here we have xymine. Xymine uh, that is on the in the strand uh, of the DNA would be substituted with uh, uracil on the message RNA strand. So uh, we call the strand uh, coding and bottom strand uh, would be non-coding. And uh, here we also can put 5 prime and here for the uh, message RNA and three prime n here and this is going to be a direction uh, in which it grows and I show here it's already released part, partly released from the uh, DNA and if it is uh, for example bacteria cell it would be instantly uh, trans translated into the protein sequence so um, we also may show other ends of the DNA strand so here going to be uh, 3 prime end and 5 prime end here 5 prime end and 3 prime end here so as you see top strand of the DNA has the same prime ends as the message RNA and also as long as message RNA contains sense in it so uh, top strand that is coding strand also would have sense so we also call it sense strand and bottom strand would be uh, uh, anti-sense so um, also bottom strand is complementary to the message RNA and we also call it as a template And we also can call a uh, top strand as non template. And also we can call a uh, top strand positive and bottom strand negative. So uh, this would help us to name. Uh, primers. Here is a second picture and this is going to be the same strand of DNA and here going to be our primers so here going to be uh, one primer and this is going to be five prime end of the primer and three prime end of the primer and it's going to grow from five to three direction and this is going to be forward direction and also we produce same sequence as on the sense strength of the DNA so this is also going to be uh, forward and sense strength of the DNA 
so this is going to be forward and sense primer and when we design the second primer that is going to be uh, growing in the opposite direction also from 5 to 3 direction but uh, it's going to be opposite to uh, uh, sense or forward primer so we call this primer reverse and anti-sense because uh, new strength of DNA that we produce would be the same uh, as we have for the um, anti-sense strength of the DNA so this is going to be reverse and it's also going to be anti-sense primer so hopefully now I clarified this uh, naming of the primers. It's a little bit conf uh, there is a little bit confusion, of course, can be because we have eight different names for the uh, two strands of DNA and at least two names for each primer. But now I hope you would be able easily to identify each primer. So. Thank you for attention. Please subscribe to my new videos. That's all for today. Goodbye.